John and I thought we'd visit our castle today. I don't know. I haven't invited all these people. I have no idea what they're doing here. How dare they? How dare they? Goose poop. Everywhere. Yeah, I think I'm going to stand here. My little goose poop. You don't know what I am. Here he comes. You look very, uh, determined. <laughs> You're like, damn straight, I'm gonna climb this sidewalk. <laughs> yep, our home is our castle. <laughs> oh, someone's planted the garbage bags. <laughs> I think those are to protect the, uh, bushes from the weather. I don't know. And, uh, the beautiful scenery down to the water. This is the uh, the ancient place where they people used to keep their kids when they wanted to do something they'd shove them in this little thing and then they'd go off and have a good time to have a beer. I'm just kidding. Don't fall back, John. So, there's a few movies that were filmed here. There was the um, Deadpool and the what was it? That 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 movie about the kids with all the powers. Well. <laughs> Yeah, un <laughs> unless little women were like, you know, could run at the speed of sound and and turned into fire bolts and stuff. I I think we're we're going up. Well, it's not a bad day in February. It's sunny and overcast too and not really that cold. He's a happy dog. John was saying how this was a used as a uh, scene in Little Women for uh, an art school um, scene. This this area does get a lot of movies filmed here because it's uh it's pretty has a real regalness to it oh i'd like to go up to the very top if i could but we can't it's not open not on the inside <laughs> These are where they would keep the really short children. They really didn't like children, did they? This is the, I guess, the main entrance. But it is closed, probably because of COVID, I would think. A Naval Military Academy, 1941. A fine woman. I don't know who she is, but... So if you want to read these, just hit the stop and take a read. And we're going in.
you stay one peacock apart? <laughs> well, that's cute. Italian garden. All oh, the crocuses are croaking. Well, they're not croaking, actually. They're Can you imagine this in in summer? How beautiful it would be, and it would be a perfect spot for someone to to get married and have beautiful pictures taken. I think. Yeah. Yeah. So in there is where they had an easel painting. Oh, cool. In that area, and at one point the director brought me over here and he has a, 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 a foreground of kind of silhouette of my face. Okay. He was shooting out there and he wanted to see what it looked like. To Did you have a beard then? Because that would have fit the time. Yeah. I was yeah. kind of cropped so hair all the same way. Okay. To my shoulders. Did they make you, did they give you costumes to wear? Cause it, yeah, I was wearing a, some type of suit. Okay. Interesting. Wow. Yeah, this is John speaking of the time he um he was an extra for uh for the movie Little Women. It was the which version, the one that had uh early, early 90s, early 90s. So Winona Ryder. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I was kind of here with a flag people and they chose me because I'm an artist and I need to paint a portrait of someone. That's very cool. So they've got these bushes all covered up for uh, weather reasons. They protect their gardens. Just look at those crocuses coming up. Wow. Oh, I just, I love the, the way the shadows come through and the window. Oh, this is such a nice angle. I would love to film someone coming around the corner in a, you know, sort of turn of the century maybe outfit. Yeah. Gardens are just starting to come alive. Little buds on things. Oh, sorry. Yeah. So, people, as I tend to call you, um, this must be the croquet lawn. I haven't been to this place in um, decades, I believe. Oh, there's a little squirrel way in the distance. So it's interesting and I really would love to come back here in the summer and just see the garden sort of full and blooming and because these, all these areas with just dirt, it's, it's going to be filled with plants by the time the summer comes around. Um, Naval College <sighs> killed in action all oh, people that went to this college. Bless their hearts and their spirits. Ooh, they got a cami house here. See, these things are for the nature spirits in Shintoism. And a lot of people just get them because they think they're pretty. They don't realize there's a point to them. Oh, aren't these trees neat? These cedars are so liney. Gunk cabbage. It doesn't have the most beautiful name, but those bright yellow flowers are called skunk cabbage. 
There's another cami house over there. Look at that tree is so is so pruned. There's virtually no limbs. It's like just the one right in front there. It's like all bumps. What does this mean? These look like huge what rhododendron bushes that have grown into trees. The leaves are like rhododendron leaves. I've never seen such a thing. Wow. How oh, beautiful. Definitely a Japanese garden in very early, well, Supposedly still winter, but I like to think of this as early spring. Well, yeah, folks, there's a view of me. You've been mostly seeing the the grounds and <laughs> the gardens and the back of John. So here's me <laughs> with my mask on because I care about others, <laughs> unlike some people. Oh, John's been wearing his primarily, but there are some people who don't, but that's their choice. Anyway, so first week in March and we have rhododendrons growing, at least on this big tree bush. Goodbye little Japanese garden. <laughs> <laughs>